all right so what is up guys savage gaming here and today i'm going to be giving you a review and mic test for my uh razor siren mic that i just bought about a week ago so yeah uh and the mic test will be at the end of the video so yeah stay tuned for that all right so um just start off i just want to say the uh, packaging for the razor siren mic was oh it was tremendous it was great um apple and razor both have some really good packaging uh, my unboxing experience was very well i really liked it all right, so next we have the sound on the Razer Siren. Uh, the Razer Siren, uh, I really like the audio on it. Uh, it was way better compared to my last mic. Uh, I had some Turtle Beach uh, PX22s. Uh, they, were, they were, I mean, they, they worked, but you know, the upgrade to an actual microphone was huge jump. It was really, really good. Uh, and using the microphone in conjunction with my uh, HyperX Cloud 2 headset, that's all. Oh, it's really, it's really, it's really good. Uh, it's a good combination. So yeah, the audio was was pretty good. It's really solid. Uh, don't have any problems with the the me talking or the popping or anything. I didn't buy the pop filter for the microphone, but I I don't think I would have used it. I don't think it would help too much with the sound quality. I mean, maybe a little bit here and there, but you know, it's, it's a really good mic. Uh, one thing I do want to say though with the uh, audio, when you if you have headphones on and your gain is turned up a lot in the back, uh, the back of the microphone. When you put your, if you put your headphones on the side of the little uh, tighten, the things that tighten the mic to stay in place, if you put your uh, headset on the side of that, it will make the mic like ring. It's it's really loud. It's really annoying too. So yeah, that's the only thing I don't like about the the mic. I can't put, I can't put my headset on unless the gain is turned way down, which kind of annoys me there. But it's not too big of a deal. All right, so next up we have the um, the design for this microphone. It's very very sleek, very nice, uh, solid design. Like, I really like the toggles, the uh, volume, it's in the front, it has a little LED um, screen you can look at to see what recording pattern you're using, and uh, it adjusts the volume of your uh, headset that you're using, so you can hear how loud you're actually talking. So that's really cool. Uh, the I like how it comes with the stand, so you don't have to worry about buying a stand. If you did buy the shock mount, with the, uh, you have to buy a arm separate, so I, did, I didn't want to deal with that, I just got the actual mic with the, with the stand, so yeah, that was, that was good. Uh, yeah, I really, and I also really like how it has the uh, little tighten tighteners on the side to uh, adjust the tightness of your head uh, of your microphone. So if you want to make it loose, so you can uh, adjust uh, what angle it's pointing at, up or down, left, whatever. Uh, yeah, you can tight untighten it and tighten it to adjust that. And then when you want to keep it in one spot, go ahead and tighten it, and then it'll it's it's really it stays really good. I keep it kind of medium though, so if I want to adjust the uh, adjust the angle, I can easily just adjust the angle just like that yeah so so yeah that's really cool all right so next i want to talk about the cons on these uh razor siren microphone uh the first thing i really didn't like about this when i plugged it in was uh, all the background noise it picks up so if your gain is turned up quite a bit and like me i have brothers and friends always over so it's always it's real loud so if someone's talking in the background you can really easily hear it like same with when you're typing when you type it's it's pretty loud even if you turn your gain down like i'll just turn it down i turn it down you can still hear the uh, typing pretty easily. So that, that's one thing I don't like about this microphone. Uh, the second thing is, if you touch it, if you just like, it, you can hear it easily. Even if you're barely touching it, like I'm just barely touching like, like like I'm typing really lightly. And it picks up quite a bit. Same if you're moving it, like you're moving it around, you can always, and when it, like if you're moving it and it scoots on your uh, little table or whatever, you can really hear the uh, vibration, which I hate. So like, let me see if I can get it to vibrate. So it's, it's, I don't like it. It's, that's the one thing I don't like about this mic. But otherwise, uh, this mic is a great microphone. Uh, love everything about it. Love the LED glowing razor logo, the LED mute button. When you click it, it turns red, so that way you know you're muted. That's really, I, I use that quite a bit in recordings. Uh, honestly, it was really useful. So yeah, those are just some cons. All right, guys, so last but not least, the part y'all have all been waiting for is the um, mic test. So yeah, I'm just gonna say a sentence. Uh, I don't really know the proper sentence mic review i'm just gonna say uh the lazy dog jumped over the moon i think it's something like that i'm not sure but uh before i start this i want to tell y'all i'm on the uh, cardioid recording pattern and my volume on my mic is uh, halfway and the gain is also halfway so just just uh and my mic is also to the left of my uh computer so yeah it's about about a foot away from my uh from my mouth and it's to the left of my uh, keyboard so yeah the lazy dog jumped over the moon.
Okay, so now I'm going to do the same sentence, but I'm going to put the microphone in front of my face. So I'm going to be facing the computer, and the mic is going to be in front of me. The lazy dog jumped over the moon. Okay, so the rest of this video, I'm going to be recording with the mic in front of my face. Um, I don't know if you guys can tell the difference, but I think there was a little bit of a difference in my voice. Uh, I think you can hear me just a little more clear. But yeah, it's... Uh, so yeah, that's the difference between the mic in front of me and the microphone to the side. So right now, the microphone's to the side of me. I'm facing the computer, and it's it's left. So yeah, now I'm moving the microphone again. The microphone is in front of me. I can tell through my headset that I can you can hear me a little more clearly. So yeah, that's just a mic test with the mic in front of me and off to the side. So yeah, that was my uh, Razor Siren review uh, and mic test. I hope you guys enjoyed.